Hi everyone. So in this class, we are just talking about the grid system of the Bootstrap. So actually, Bootstrap has a grid of 12 columns, and uh, you can actually place the whole web page between these uh, 12 columns. And well, this is not necessary to use the, the all 12 columns. You can use two or three or five columns, whatever you need, and you can make them wider according to your need. This is a single thing. But how to use the column and what the benefit we can get from the these 12 columns? So just simply that we don't need to care about uh, really care about the uh, width, the height, the actually the margins, the padding another thing which depends on the dimensions because there we have the grid system so how to use that grid system just simply put the div inside the container okay the container uh, is the main and inside the container I'm just typing here the class you know that everything you just want to put inside the bootstrap we have to use a class for that so here I just put it the class and then just type call MD now just type whatever grid and uh, actually however size you want for example I just want the 12th the 12th level grid system means 1 to 12 or if I just type 6 means 1 to 6 here I'm just typing 12 and then what the mean of that I'm just talking about the whole width okay for example I'm just pressing enter and putting a color here the style the background color and the color I'm just putting as light blue okay I just put it light blue here and then here I'm just typing hello now save that go to the browser and refresh that now this is the hello you can see if I just type 6 just suppose if I just type 6 refresh that now it's the 6 level grid okay it has actually 6 columns and uh, I'm, I'm just duplicating this and this one has two columns and the background color is light green the grid system is really easy to understand just focus on that now you can see that these are six columns and these are only two columns and now we have the four column left just duplicate that and if I just type four here and let's just type the orange or any color whatever you prefer let's just refresh that now the whole screen has been covered if I just type 5 here, oh sorry about that, this is the actual 4 and refresh that now, this is the perfect one. Now if I just type the 5 here and save that back and refresh that now, you can see that it's impossible to put the 13 columns in a single line, that is why the whole 5 columns are there because the whole 5 columns is in the single div. So this is the great system of the bootstrap. We can type 5 here, so the mean is that 5, 5 and 2, which means the 12. Refresh that now. We just cleared the problem by adding only 12 columns in a single raw. Definitely it has a raw as well, so I can add the div here for the raw. Class and equal to raw. Nothing more to do here. And let's just press uh, and let's just put all these uh, columns here inside the raw and why this is beneficent to use the raw I'm just guiding you again just creating uh, creating another div and typing class raw okay and there I'm just actually copying only two one not the whole here I'm just pasting this saving and going to the browser and refreshing now all the things the same you can see that but if I just copy the last one and instead of pasting inside the raw, I'm just pasting this out of the raw and saving and refreshing now. You can see that the next one's hello is not in the raw. Actually, this is after the element. And now by using the raw, you can see that it just actually healed up the extra space of the fluid, the container's fluid. Okay, now it's still it's not actually uh, going after the container you can see that it has a space if I just use the container but if I just use the container fluid now because of the ROS we, we are we actually covering the whole space but not breaking by the way it's out of the raw so it is it ha it ha is still having the extra space but now these elements having the extra space but actually inside the raw and actually inside the column so I hope you understood about the rows and the columns but one thing more I just want to clear you that there are multiple type of the columns for example I'm just guiding you in this way okay so here we can use the 
SM or the X as SM MD LG LG so what is the difference between the XS SM MD and LG the S XS is for the extra small devices like mobile phone or something mobile okay the SM for the small devices like tabs and the iPads or whatever the medium size is for the monitors general monitors and LCD for laptops and PCs so medium okay and the extra the large is actually for just like the iMac and that type of devices so we can use any of them if uh, according to our need but I'm just using the medium because medium is suitable for all type of devices we can use the medium for small devices for mobile devices for large devices so simply don't just uh, change this MD to SM well you can change the MD to SM it won't give you the change result it will be same but actually the medium is for the whole devices so mo the best is medium to work so I hope you understood the whole thing about the grid system we will learn some more things in the next class stay tuned and goodbye